Hello everyone and welcome back to my vlog. This is Mama. Fact you. I held fact for you. Hi guys, this is Alisa Nuevo on Boys Got So Una, pero hunting boys karong panahuna. And welcome back to my vlog. So today we will be talking about the health related components of fitness. But before anything else, let us talk about what is fitness. Let us first define what is fitness. So, physical fitness is a state of health and well being. And more specifically, the ability to perform aspects of sports, occupations, and daily activities. So physical fitness is generally achieved through proper nutrition, moderate vigorous physical exercise, and sufficient rest. So there are five components of health fitness, namely the cardiovascular endurance, muscular strength, muscular endurance, flexibility, and body composition. So first up, we have the cardiovascular endurance. So what is cardiovascular endurance? It is how efficiently your heart, blood vessels, and lungs to supply oxygen-rich blood to working muscles during physical activity, such as uh, aerobic activity like walking, running, cycling, or playing sport for a prolonged period of time or for more than 60 seconds. And now we have the muscular strength. So muscular strength is the ability to generate the maximal amount of force while performing a particular exercise or to put it simply, it refers to the amount of force a muscle can produce in a single maximal effort. So uh, examples of muscle strengthening activities including includes rather weight with a uh, weight lifting, working with resistance bands, heavy gardening such as shoveling or groveling. And now we have the muscular endurance, which is the ability of a muscle or a group of muscle to perform extractions against a force for an extended period of time. So the greater your muscular endurance is, is the higher the number of repetitions you could complete. An example of that is swimming, running, cycling, and, uh, and other similar activities that involve a repetitive motion over a longer period of time. And now we have here the flexibility, which is the range of motion in a joint or group of joints or the ability to move joints effectively through a complete range of motion. So flexibility training includes stretching, exercise to lengthen the muscles, uh, and may include activities like Tai Chi or yoga. So improving the flexibility can help you move more comfortably throughout the day. And last but not the least, in the five components of health-related fitness, we have the body composition. So body composition is the method of breaking down the body into core components, such as the fat, protein, minerals, and body water. So it describes your weight more accurately and provides a better glimpse into your overall health and your traditional methods. So there is also a body composition analysis. Can, which uh, can accurately show the changes in fat mass, muscle mass, and the body fat percentage. And there are also uh, the body mass index. So these are all the five components of health-related fitness. So thank you guys. I hope you have enjoyed the video and learned a lot from it. So see you in my next vlog. Bye!